This is a Carnegie Institution for Science audio news release for Friday, June 5, 2009. Colossal Magnetic Effect Under Pressure Today's pocket-sized music players hold thousands of songs, thanks to the discovery 20 years ago of the giant magnetoresistance effect. This made it possible to pack more data onto smaller and smaller hard drives. Scientists are now studying the Colossal Magnetoresistance Effect, or CMR. It is up to a thousand times more powerful and could trigger another revolution in computing technology. CMR is a property of materials called manganites, which makes them invaluable components in technological applications. An example is the soon-to-be-marketed Magnetic Random Access Memory, or MRAM. Unlike conventional memory, MRAM could make possible instant-on computers. However, no current theories can fully explain CMR effects. Yang Ding is a researcher at Carnegie Institution's High Pressure Synergetic Center. He studies the magnetic properties of manganites at the Advanced Photon Source at Oregon National Laboratory in Illinois. Samples are subjected to hundreds of thousands of atmospheres of pressure, while X-rays probe the magnetic properties of the material. The properties are difficult to study, but pressure has a unique ability to tune electron interactions in a clean and theoretically transparent manner. It is a direct and effective means for manipulating the behavior of electrons. At 230,000 atmospheres, the electrons in manganite undergo a transition where they switch from having aligned spins to having opposed spins. Because the shift does not happen throughout the sample at the same time, it's possible there may be two phases at a very small scale, even under normal pressure conditions. The research appears in the June 12, 2009 issue of the journal, Physical Review Letters. For more information, see our website at www.ciw.edu. This is John Strom for the Carnegie Institution.